So if you happen to find a tick on yourself or your family member this year, first thing I always recommend is to grab a pair of tweezers, get as close to the skin as possible around the tick, pull straight up and away with consistent pressure. At that point, wash your skin with some soap and water and try to identify the tick if you can. The most common ticks that we have in Middlesex London region are dog ticks and black legged ticks. Now it's important to know the difference between the two because dog ticks don't transmit Lyme disease, but black legged ticks can. Some great characteristics to look for when you're looking to identify these ticks. Uh, if it's a dog tick, you should see some white coloring on its back. So male dog ticks have some white lightning bolts down their entire back and uh, female dog ticks have some white coloring towards their head. They have eight legs and they're about the same size of about a pencil eraser, so they're a pretty good size. On the other hand, black legged ticks are a lot smaller. They're about the size of a sesame seed. Once again, they have eight legs as well too, but the female black legged ticks have some red and orange coloring along their back. So that's a great identifier for those ones. If you're not sure what type of tick you found, feel free to drop them off at the health unit and we can identify it for you. And if needed, we could also send them away for testing. Another great resource for you is healthunit.com slash ticks, where there's some great quality uh, pictures as well as some resources available to help you and your family stay safe from tick bites this summer. If you do have any concerns about a tick bite, reach out to your healthcare provider. Thanks very much for watching, stay safe and enjoy the outdoors.